how bright is your flash? In this tutorial we'll find out just how useful that flash is in terms of its output. Here are some typical flash guns. A Canon 580 on the left, a 430 on the right. In the middle a flash gun with a name that I can't pronounce but its model number is 460. Why these numbers? Because these are the guide numbers 58, 43, 46. The guide number then is an accurate reference for how much light a flash gives off at its maximum output at a given sensitivity or ISO. The aperture you set when using manual control is the guide number divided by the distance. For example, a guide number of 58, distance 2 meters, aperture f29. Realistically, this wouldn't happen. The flash would either be dimmed automatically or set to a lower output by the photographer, I would think. The scales and panels on the back of a flash gun uh, show the calculated apertures and distances at given sensitivities. In auto mode, they may only show maximum possible distances. A zoom head on the flash can influence the output. The further it's zoomed, the brighter it is at a given point. The ISO setting of the camera, the angle of the flash and the surrounding walls or lack of walls to reflect bouncing light are also influential factors. Flash is a blessing and a curse. It will often ruin the ambiance of a picture, create red eye and flatten perceived depth. Use it with caution. OK, that's it. This is Lawrence of Crometti Commercial 077 318 97312. There are more tutorials coming. Please let me know if there's anything you'd particularly like to hear me do. Thanks. Bye.